Good morning. Oh, my camera's way low. Good morning, everybody. Hello, you. How are we? <laughs> good morning, good morning. Let me get the dog in here so I can shut the door. Indy. Come on, Pop. In your bed. She's been on nights all night. Hey, how we doing, folks? Make some fancy electric kettle tea. Nice. Uh, right then. Oh, please add me as a friend before you start. Where, where Danny? Uh, on Steam, I don't know. I don't accept friends on Steam, I'm afraid. Uh, okay, let's jump in. Right, how we doing, folks? Hope you're well. Got my coffee. You got coffee? You got tea? What else you got? Ooh, I'm gonna go and mine. Never mind. We'll just add to the flavour. Yeah. Scotch, nice. <laughs> Good stuff. Yeah, I hope you're having a good uh, a good morning. Uh, can you have people on just so that they can go look at you? No, sorry, Danny. I don't. I don't have friends on Steam because he uh, constantly sort of pops up in the corner and uh, makes a mess. It's a nightcap. Oh, that's fine. So it's, you're, as, as long as you're not like at nine a.m. in the morning, then that's fine. <laughs> uh, how's Sanders' toe? It's okay. It's, it's bandaged up and he, he's gone to daycare today. He hasn't really noticed it this morning. Just a little sore, you know. It's like with a blister. Um, just got a, just a. Decent sized blister on his big toe, that was all really. But it's very uncomfortable, you know. Uh, Earl Grey or peppermint black tea? Uh, I'd go Earl Grey first thing. I know peppermint's meant to be good for the digestive and stuff, but uh, um, yeah, I don't. Uh, I, I'd go Earl Grey first thing, definitely, yeah. Good morning, although it is the afternoon here. Nice coffee. Uh, we will take a Fanta now. Sounds good, Joyce. Uh, just got my dog desexed. He's very sad. I know. Poor things, eh? Indy was a trooper, man. She did really well with hers. She wouldn't even notice, really. We're jumping around the next day and stuff. Done and done. Ilgrave's what I was thinking. Oh, good. I'm happy I could help. Um, okay. Hello from the UK. Hi, Polly. So, today then, we're going to start working on what we should have started working on yesterday. Uh, black coffee or milk and sugar? Black coffee for me. Uh, just straight up. All it has to do is be black, warm, and wet. It doesn't have to be that warm, to be honest. Nothing from Wales. Hi, Boris. I hope Wales is treating you well. Is it wet there? It's a bit, bit of a cliche to say that Wales is wet, but uh, it is. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, yeah, so we were going to do Koality Kitchen. Uh, it was going to be a food court here that sort of backs onto this uh, space here. So that's the, uh, that's the plan. What I am tempted to do... Let's get rid of that and uh, and do it with this so that the whole area matches. But what I might do is just knock the tone down on that a little bit. More of a sort of grey. It just looks like dirt, doesn't it? Let's have a look. Move all that way. Yeah, yeah, there we go. That's it there. Okay, cool. Uh, love me too. I'm from the Netherlands, by the way. Hi, how's it going? We've got a very multi, uh, multifaceted, multicultural uh, grouping today. It's awesome. Well, we do every day, actually. I like that uh, geekism has no borders. The sun never sets on the geekism community. <laughs> I don't know whether that's wholly true or not. Nice and sunny here in Dublin. Oh, beautiful. It's a beautiful part of the world, Dublin. I have many, many good memories from my time there, uh, which was too short. Okay, so here the line doesn't quite line up, but that's okay. Indy, you make yourself poorly, baby. Indy's got a bit of a scabby patch on her skin. Uh, we're going to take her to the doctors on Tuesday. Unfortunately, it's a, a long weekend here in Canada. It's Canadian Thanksgiving on Monday. So uh, we can't. I'll get her seed until there, but she's obviously scratching. It's obviously irritating her. I don't think it's like a skin condition. It looks like she might have lay, lay in something, maybe. I don't know. It's just like a really strange patch, but it does look a little bit mangy, so I, I hope it's not mange. Uh, raining in Staffordshire. Probably could have guessed it. Yeah, Staffordshire's wet. It's because it's right in the middle. It's God's country. Not that I believe in a God, of course, but, you know, 
there was one. He'd love Staffordshire. She'd love Staffordshire. They would love Staffordshire, I suppose. Uh, okay, so that's where that's going to go to. There we go. Quick fix, but it's all the same now. That's good. Morning from Tennessee in the good old US of A. Hello from Tennessee. Hello to Tennessee, even. I've not been to Tennessee. Perhaps I'll end up there at one point. Um, Indiana as well. Nice. Look at the people. Are oh, vet bills. I know, right? I always kind of hope that I walk in, they go, oh, yeah, this is so-and-so. It's very common. Here's a cream. It's $20. But it doesn't work like that, does it? It's, uh, oh, yeah, that's, well, that's, you need some bloods taken. That's $200. Like, why? Well, she's got, let's leave her blood in her. Flopped her head. I mean, in Hull at the minute, it's been very rainy. Hull. I um, spent a lot of time in Hull back when I was in the UK. Um, and I, I can't say I was a massive fan of the place. People were lovely, but the actual Hull itself wasn't great. Uh, okay, food. Guest facilities. Now you're scratching your ear. You're just riffy, aren't you? You're just a riffy dog. You hear that? Absolutely going at it. You done there, people are watching you? Yeah? Oh. Alright. Good screen all. <laughs> From uh, Saskatchewan, lovely. Okay, that ear a scritch. You get scritchy ears, don't you? you clean them later, eh? You clean your ears today. Oof, <laughs> there we go. All right, let's settle on your bed, baby. Right then, food. Let's have a look. What have we got? Chief Beef, Cosmic Cow, Hot Dog Squad, Excelente, Missy Good, Miss Your Fries or Pizza Pen. But nothing. Hey Andrew, how's it going buddy? So, I suppose a Chief Beef, uh, ice cream, uh, and uh, drinks, milkshakes, slush, sort of a soda, and then milkshakes. Yeah. And then we'll do some bathrooms. And that one there. There we go. All right. So, what we actually want to do first of all is crack these off the grid, but that's fine. So. And I move the grid down to two and then put that there. Okay, and that, they, they're going to be our two starting ones. Okay, and we're going to do this as like a QRS band. Um, It must be pretty sad hell because the uh, coronavirus has cancelled the. Well, the coronavirus hasn't cancelled it, but people have cancelled the whole fair. And it's the first time in 700 years since he's been gone. Yeah, well, I mean, you know, everything. With the Western Fair here was cancelled this year, which is their big, uh, their big one. Right, I'm gonna split all these off. I, mean, I should just should have just built them separately, shouldn't I? Okay, that's how we want bathrooms. Okay, so move you down to here. I'll move the whole thing. There we go. That's what I want to do. About there, uh, big owner has cancelled everything. Yeah, it's been the world over, right? So let's select that group. And move it to there. Yeah, and then. Ooh. 
What's that puppy? Can you hear your mum? Let me get up. Okay. Yep. All right. Happy with that. Not bad here. Just stubborn duchies refuse to even play the follow rule. I mean, it's everywhere, right? Everyone's having their problems with people not doing as they're told. So I think in Ontario the other day that was like, you don't have to wear a mask in here. Well, yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. Right then, what are we thinking about walls? Uh, Australian wood wall. I mean, that sounds like a pretty solid beginning. It's nice, nice plain wood. So we'll start with that, I think. Uh, that should probably come out another one, shouldn't it? Because I don't really treat these boxes as, as the... They, I always think of these boxes as the doorway, you know? So... I'm actually make that two meters. Yeah, I'll tell you what, we'll do that. We'll, we'll select everything uh, and move it so it's just a little bit of an edge away. There we go. Because then we can do a bit more of an interesting uh, shape. In the UK, it's hard to do as we're told uh, when we're told something new and contradictory every week. It is difficult, yeah. The UK seems to be very sort of flippy, flippy floppy. Here, it's not so bad. They have... Um, they have a pretty solid system here. It kind of works on like a like a colors, you know, like a, we're we're in code red type thing. And and uh, well, it's like a, a number level. So we're currently in lockdown three, um, but at any point we can sort of go roll back to two or or, or whatever. So there are a few specific rules that they've put into place for uh, some businesses. Um, so. Uh, like specifically strip clubs are closed right now you know of all things um whereas the other bars and restaurants are able to open with you know with distancing measures and stuff okay, okay, okay. so is that just a two and a half right so that's what we need to put in there okay uh, where's the basically we're going to box out the um Where's just the plain wood? Oh, there it is. We're just going to box out the shape of this, first of all. Is that going to chop into the... Yep. Okay, so we'll figure that another way. And then, we're, and then we'll do all the, the fun stuff and make it look good and stuff, right? What I'm thinking is that should line up quite nicely with that. Look at that. Okay. Uh, not the strip club. I know, right? Not the strip clubs. The thing that gets me with the whole COVID is a hoax thing is like, it, in the US at least, it seems to be mostly Democrats who are playing the whole COVID is a hoax thing. Like, their leader has got it. Like, so do they not believe him now? Like, I just, I just don't get it. I mean, you, there's no there's no arguing with um, with those sort of uh, people. Right? Because they just... It, it doesn't matter that, that Trump has got it. It's still a hoax. It's a hoax, but it's not as bad. Like... Because I've heard the same. I've heard the same person, Republican. Excuse me. Sorry. Yeah, I've heard. Um, I've heard the same person say that it is a hoax and that it's real, but it's not that bad. Like in the same sentence. So, like, so, so which is it? What, which, what do you believe? Just what you. The, all it is. It's not that they believe something specific. They just don't believe the the difficult truth, right? It's that whole, uh, you know, which would you rather, an easy lie or a difficult truth? Okay, so we just push that out a little bit there. I think that looks cute. I'll do that somewhere else as well. Stay apart today so we can be together tomorrow. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, I like that. So what I'm thinking is that that will be a nice way of Sort of tying some of this together, perhaps. So I can put that there. Hmm, it's a little snug. What I might do is come to this and this. And just scooch it over a little. There we go. That's the good thing with these this sort of modular build. Now, oh my god, I'm not looking forward to putting a roof on this. We'll probably just do a flat roof and, and make it easy. But I like I like that. I like that sticky out bit. That's good. Uh, what's your favourite theme in Planet Zoo? Um, I don't know. 
don't know. I don't have any favourites in Planet Zoo. If you were designing a game, what kind of game would it be? Well, I... <laughs> I always say this question, oh, I'm not saying anything because you know it might happen, but I just I, I don't know how it'll ever happen. But I, I have a I have a design a design document for a game that I would love to make or, you know, be in a position where I could get other people to make it for me. Um for a for a sim tycoon style game, you know. Uh, how are you coping with no strip clubs? Well, my income's down, obviously, because, you know, I used to do that on the side to earn a bit of cash. But uh, other than that, I'm, <laughs> I'm coping okay. Uh, just pop my cake in the oven. That's Oh, nice, Chloe. What sort of cake are we having? Trump's saying the best healthcare. Yeah, I, I still think we haven't seen the end of what he's doing to Trump either. You know, like, he's absolutely dosed up right now on everything under the sun like you say the best the best stuff available i i, I so um pence has cancelled all of his uh, prior engagements and he's heading back to the white house so that to me says either pence has got it or you know they, they might even be looking at invoking the invoking the 25th you know so who knows who knows what's going on over there Okay. Yeah, I like those. That's good. All right. That fly took him down. Yeah, right. What song do you strip to? Um, the the birdie song. <laughs> um, uh, banana cake. Lovely. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, yep, I'm happy with those. Um, where 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 do we go next? What, what what's next? I suppose let's finish off the structure of the building. So, we can come here, keep that all neat. I mean that's kind of perfect. And then we'll at the backstage we'll shift to more of a uh, utilitarian wall. So something like this breeze block. Please put it on the loop. Yeah, yeah, see me do it. Your birthday party, remember? That's how we met. <laughs> okay, so oh, where are we gonna join all this up? I mean, like that. I don't just want to do like a, a corner there. I think that's gonna look a bit weird. But we could definitely bring this that way. And then we do. We just we're just making work for ourselves. But it's okay. We'll, we'll bring that there. And then we'll put a few in. I don't think we need that many, but that can give us the angle. If you're ever wondering how to do non non boxy shapes, by the way, here, here's your uh, here's your quick and dirty method. Keep going until they kind of line up. Pop that one into place. Uh, take that one piece on its own and split it. And then just check what your clipping's like. There's a little clipping, so we'll just knock it back just a touch. There we go. Let's see, you get non square boxes. Happy Friday. Happy Friday indeed. Well, that's how I met Sapphire. Yes, of course. Sapphire de Mont. Uh What's the vision? I don't mean. What have I, what have I missed? It's the baby shark song. <laughs> Trippy to baby straw, that'd be cool. Right. Do you think the next Frontier game will be? Um, I think. I think it's. I don't, I'm not too hundred percent sure on the timeline. I guess it's going to be that F1 management title. I think that's probably next. Um, so I don't. So there's nothing else this year, and I think I think the two. Actually, no, no, isn't isn't F1 management twenty? No, it is. Yeah, twenty twenty one is the F1 management game, and then I think the only other one we know about is the is the Age of Sigmar 
uh, Warhammer RTS, which is 2022. Right? So, uh, other than that, I don't know. Hey, Lulani. Hey, Lulani. That's close, wasn't it? Planet Strip Club. I play the hell out of Planet Strip Club. <laughs> <laughs> can you change the culture yes we will yeah we'll go in and uh, fancy those up a little bit oh, it's kind of annoying me that they don't match why don't why don't they match they should match you are you're on the same grid as you How weird. Right. Do we have the... Yeah, we do have the stations, because there's just trains and stuff, I guess, don't we? I was going to say, do we have these here? What the hell grid are we on now? <laughs> Sorry. I completely lost where we are. Right, okay. I think we'll do it this way instead. There we go. Probably, probably Lou, that'd be nice. Tomb Blaster Challenger, which is quite nice. Terror Tomb is the best dark ride in the UK. Shame it's never been quite the same. Is it good? Is it? I, I, I don't know whether I've ridden it. Tomb Blaster, I think, is probably the one I, I've been on. Now, is that too low for people to get through? I can't imagine it is. No. Okay, we'll, we'll stick with that then, rather than trying to be fancy. Now, this is obviously a little off, but that's okay. So we'll take those three there, swing them. Yeah, because that's a little off because of the because of the wall connecting, but I'm okay, I can deal with that. That's the sort of thing that you get. In fact, I might even make it even more pronounced. Make the path into the toilets a little bit thinner. Yeah, that's good. Drew, open the mind about how tall the four meter walls were the other night on the street. Yes, yeah, four meters is. I mean, four meters in real life is pretty high, right? I think, I think actually, four four meter grid isn't really four meters unless the characters are like two foot two meters tall. You know, because like look at a four meter grid is. Now we've got an easy four meter grid to look at here. I don't think suppose I have a lie compared to you. Alright, so four meters. But I, I reckon if you put a four meter wall. Oh no, maybe it's about right actually, yeah. So as you know, I know height in feet, so I'm six foot. So what's that in meters? One point eight, so I need two meters. Yeah, so one point eight, so that's two meters there. So four meters. So yeah, no, it probably is relatively in scale. Um, but yeah, four meter high walls are, are pretty crazy high. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta say, I love these casual whatever streams. Oh, nice. I had to stop playing myself because the X key start working. No way, I'm building until a new keyboard comes. Oh no, oh, it's, the, it's the keyboard though. Yeah, and not the game, not a game issue. That's fine then. Tomb Blaster is where they've. Oh yeah, they stick these guns in them. I never like when they do that. To be honest with you, I, I always think the Haunted House at Alton Towers lost something when it became dual. Okay, so then this is going to be our sort of four court space, right? Uh, I just I don't like that there. I feel like that should be done. I think it should be slightly more curved. And again, I know I understand that we're just making work for ourselves, but I just feel like it deserves it. Come on, 
koalas you could see nice Oh, can fit a mouse. Yeah, I, f I find the best best thing with scale really is to is to get a person in front of it. You know, that really helps get an actual in-game character in front of you. Oh, oh, he's gonna be. Yeah, these these four meter high walls. There's not. It isn't very often that a building will go higher than this. Like we've got a couple of like display, you know, sort of standing areas that would be quite that would be considered high up and that tower but otherwise i try and keep to that four to five meter high really the whale weather vane yes well for scale that's right we figured that out in back in beta right the whale for scale well the whale in the game is a roughly the size of uh of a, of a player character we don't have the animatronics obviously in the game like the archer from planet coaster that we can use Okay. Something like that. Space valve scale. Yeah, exactly. Australia would say, yeah, me too. I do really like it, actually. Um, oh, excuse me. What happened? A long, long couple of nights, Anna's not been sleeping very well this week. And his poorly foot. Milking it. Milking it, though. Jeez, that kid milks it. Didn't even acknowledge his poorly foot this morning, and then I took his sock off and he saw the plaster and he suddenly started hobbling around. <laughs> Little shite. <laughs> um, but otherwise, it's fine. It's clean and dressed, and he, he's gone to he's gone to play group today, so he's gone to big school. We call it. Now, do we try and grid this, or do we just make an absolute mess and cover it up? I think we make an absolute mess and cover it up, don't we? Yep. Absolute mess. Well, that's why you're assisting. Them. No, we can't even make them thinner. Look at that. Okay, so we need a couple of joining bits here. Let people in and out. What a mess. That'll work though. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. High Bills, well, comes out. Yes, exactly. Yeah, well, comes down when you're not really getting people up there. He'll be showing off his limp. He will, right? That's a good point, Toes. Yeah, have a group of kids, a group of people with a kid. Because sometimes you might make an uh, exhibit that children can't view into. That's a really great point, yeah. Uh, switch laps, I couldn't move because my uh, cat was sat on me. Well, yes, we, we all know this. If it fits, it sits. And then we must give the right of way to pass cats. So we'll carry this floor up then, just so that the, these connecting bits are all the same, so it's easy for us. And then we'll doing aquatic tanks, etc. I've started a shallow stadium. That's cool. Um, I saw somebody done like a they they put like a, a beluga whale or something in. What what they what the ones like dolphins, but they got big heads. Um, and it looks it looked like an abomination, but it's cool that people are trying. <laughs> All right, Beluga. Yeah, is that right? Cool. So we've got asphalt. We can do brick. What's that one? Dry stone. No, that one. All right. 
What's that one? Ice block? No. Plain wood. It's gonna just be. It's gonna be concrete, isn't it? I know. We're we're getting back to the concrete, but painted. Oh, painted brick could work. Because that could look like old that they've tried to funk up again. Let's try that painted brick. With not not what whatever colour that is. Okay, okay. There's an archer somewhere built for scaling wizard. Yeah, I think somebody did make a uh, like an archer out of art pieces, yeah. Back, tech calls getting in the way of John Stream. How dare they? How very dare they? Welcome back. Um, yeah, that corner there we're gonna have to clean up. That one's not so bad. That can just be a little border there or something. I like the green floor. So what I was thinking, just as I saw the wood there, um, I like the idea of doing something like this. Let's have a look. See if we've got like a nice wood panel that we can do something with. Wood floor. So there's these panels here. Can we change those colours? No. So that's a shame because that, it's going to start looking a little bit too much like the wall. But is there another one? There's bamboo. Where's the other like regular wood floor? Is that one? Yeah, there. Now these ones, flat, I don't think they have a non-gridded one, which is going to make this tricky, but... No, I think we'll use the Australian one. Because they're non-gridded, and we can really help ourselves out with them. Where are you? That's, that's just regular wood. And we'll do a bit of trim or something to make it look different, but yes, here we go. Should I show you you're going to roof this? I, I think we're just going to do a flat roof. Kind of like... Oh, we haven't actually got a flat roof anywhere here. So, yeah, I think we're just going to flat roof it. Just with concrete. Like this floor here. Just bring it up and... That's the easiest way to sort of fill in all of the gaps. Okay, what I'm thinking is... I just want to think the idea of doing a tiny little ledge here. And we've got to be careful because, obviously... Any guests that do end up coming in here, this is going to clip like crazy. I kind of like the idea of having it as a... There's like an in and out space. Homeless, indeed. Hip and up, blip, bloop, bloop. Oh, it's all a load of rubbish, something. Maybe a little roof over each window. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll definitely do like a little overhang. I think with some of that corrugated roof, that's really nice. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. And then we need to have a look at some uh, fence options, I think. Oh. My eyes playing a game. Well, there, I mean, there is a lot of stuff that isn't straight here because this is multiple grids, right? So that, like, if you look at the, if you look at what we've actually got built, so that stuff's on on one. These aren't gridded. There's a grid. There's a grid. There's a grid. You know, so breaking the grid is what gives you all of this sort of stuff. And then obviously the actual game is, itself is, you can use a grid if you like, but for the most part, I I try not to. It makes it more interesting and realistic. 
Uh, okay, so we need a little bit of fencing. Uh, I can remember where fencing is. Where's fencing? Fencing. Okay. Different builds in this game because they're so much harder to move. It's not great, but to be honest with you, I just kind of get to the point where wherever it is is where it stays. <laughs> so what I'm thinking is this would look cool as like a um like a do you know what I mean? Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like a divider. So you can so you actually have like two queues here. Now obviously this is going to just look awful when people come in here, but let's be honest, how often do we actually put people in the places? Uh, with you yawning and stretching, uh, it's been a very long week. Oh, awesome, I'm exhausted. Like I say, last the last two nights, Xander hasn't really slept. And so I haven't really slept because Nicola's been on nights this week, so... Um, yeah, I, uh, I think I might even go and have another hour after this stream. Refresh myself for the rest of the day. There we go. I'm so sorry. Flipping back and forth is so hard. Oh, don't worry. Uh, always hate playing with different roles. Oh yeah, especially unplanned. It's all good. Naps are always good. I don't know. You know, I don't. I don't nap well. I get. I just. Get, I get into a really deep sleep, and it makes me just feel worse. Honestly. Yeah, I would never, never feel great, but, you know, genuinely got about two hours sleep last night and probably about the same the night before, so I think maybe a nap is not a bad idea, just to get some rest. We should have yours his head off, yeah. Maybe we'll just do an hour today. And we've made good progress here today, though, I think. I like those. Abulun. I see it in there because I worked out. Yeah, like Nick as that does, but she... She does okay, but it's it's tough. It, the, the, in between them, it's not so bad because she's just exhausted. That, having that last one where she has to sort of then get up, it's never great, I don't think, for her. Uh, okay, so this is just going to be seating here. That's not a crazy problem. Uh, we'll do some condiment boxes here and here, and maybe here in the middle as well would make sense. Um, roofing. Maybe we'll just try and box off the roof a little now. Where you've actually made something. Uh, excuse me. Last stream we did. What did we do last stream? This bit of planting. Uh, the stream before that we did this bridge. So I'll have you know. This is probably the most we've built in quite a while. Actually yeah to be fair. <laughs> um, okay so plaster. Where's them non-gridded plaster pieces? These ones, right? Yeah. Well, well these things are your friend. Uh, we'll do a trim on the uh, on the whole thing as well. So what I think we'll do is we'll leave that open there, and we'll do like a trellis on top of it, which will be pretty good, I think. Otherwise. Keep it going this way. So this, so this, the box here is the actual roof. Uh, whatever that is there. Oh. That'll do. Okay. 
I have to apply for the new job again. Oh, sorry, John. He was telling you about staff restructuring meeting at work on Wednesday. My current job will be amalgamated with another job, and I have to reapply for it. Uh, not happen until next time. Oh, that kind of sucks, really, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, sorry to hear that. I'm sure you do great, but that's horrible that you have to kind of go through that process again. Uh, just got here, what are we doing? We're beginning work on a food court um, that's going to go next to the koalas and it's going to be called Koality Kitchen. First stream I've got in a long time. Hey Shelby, hope you're well. Thanks for joining us. Food court for all the food crime boys. Very good. That's a solid pun for a Friday morning. Uh, more overcrowded today, I think. Later on, by the way. I mean, I have to get one out the last couple of days because I've been poorly, but yeah. More overcrowded today. Excited for it. It's good fun, that game. And, I, and I, oh, I'm always a big... A, I'm a bit of a sucker for games that have been made by, like, one guy or, or, or two people, like... Overcrowded is made by a guy called Al and his wife who did the artwork and yeah I think that's incredible dedication and in some ways I'm very envious <laughs> mm. yeah I think definitely flat roof was the way to go here uh, we'll probably do a little bit of roofing detail around the front, but as far as the actual sort of key structure goes, yeah, flat roof is the way. Oh, come on. There we go. Stardew Valley, yeah, exactly, yeah. One guy and a bunch of GS about Rim World, and it's insane, right? Okay. Is that little gap we've got there? Oh, look at that cheeky little gap. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I thought it was the dog growling then. There's a car outside. I'll say, what's bothering her? Uh, I'm not going to cover them because I think I've just thought about that. I think I'm going to raise those up a little and do a different thing. Um, did you ever recover your Rubik's game? No, fortunately not. No, it was good fun while it lasted, but yeah, no, I never, never managed to uh, to get back to that one. We're going to have to probably come up with something clever here as well because I don't think we've got pieces small enough to do a nice and neat. Uh, oops. Yeah, not got enough to do a nice neat wall here, I don't think. Unless near roof, excuse me. So, I'm not really sure what we're going to be able to do. Maybe, maybe we'll just have to do that and then come up with something that can fill that gap. Because this is the smallest plaster piece, so... Oops. Oh, 
Ah, uh, there we go. Art pieces all zombie. Yeah, they're super shiny though, eh? I remember not to make uh, sort of acute angles on these kind of things. Okay. Right, so this is all on the same grid, right? All this stuff. So what we should be able to do, oops, is select it all. Bring it up yeah, in instantly. Instantly, that's uh, an improvement, I think. Cover it in the bottom. Okay. So now we'll take these back. Uh, what's that say going on? This is called add orangutans, please. We. This is called add orangutans, please. Orangutans. Do you mean for me to add them to this zoo? Because orangutans are in the game. But but we've already done orangutan builds. You can go and check it out if you like. I think that's what he meant. So yeah. No, yeah, there, there's we've there's an orangutan school, a zoo school on the channel already. Right. I'm I'm kind of hoping a two by two. One of these will fit. Okay, and I might I might even leave those open like that. I think that actually, looks quite nice. Yeah, I really just yeah. I, this school was great, but it was just I just haven't got the energy or interest in the game to do more of them. I'm sorry. I I know they were they were some of the best content I've done in this game. I think, but like I, at the moment, all I can really muster is chatting to you guys and and, and playing with them here. You know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what I think I might do is I might add a trim. Well, I will add a trim to the main roof, but I actually just quite like those with a with like a concrete slab on top of them. I think it looks pretty nice, a bit of minimalistic and stuff. Yeah. Uh, make it green to match the brick. That's not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, let's try that. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, they're all on the same. Are they not on the same grid or something? Yeah, that's cool. I go with that. Yeah, that one for some reason is on a different uh, on a different spot. Can they have greenery in them? The roof. Oh, greenery could work. Actually, maybe not in those, but we could totally do some like we could do some like long greenery stuff there. That could look really cool, actually. 
Great suggestion. Do something like ooh, ooh. Oh, that. Okay, and then we go back to some wood. Hamulas. Mine's a bit of like zoo again, but I always get frustrated I can't make stuff lost now. Just little little things, little things. Little bits of detail. It does help having a hundred people watching you and coming up with suggestions as well, to be fair, because I would have never have thought to do something like this, but as soon as somebody said it, I was like, oh, that could be cool. It's easy to do, and I think it's going to look nice and a bit different. Yeah. Cool. Let's find some plants that'll work in it. African daisies. I don't think I want flowers up there. I want stuff that looks like it's going to just survive without any real work, you know. Let's see what all that came in Australia. Oh no, some of the some of the Australian stuff was free, right? So is it just down here in Oshana? Right, there we go. So we've got these, they're way too big. Um, there's no real... Oh, there's that fairy fan fairy thing to get it to flower, but I'm just wondering what we've got as far as like strips go. Those things, they probably work quite well. Hmm. Are they just big old roots yet? Okay. Yeah, I'll show you didn't really add that much smaller. Alright, let's just let's not worry about it being Australian then. Uh flowers don't wear bushes would do. Yeah, exactly. So what we need is one of these like strips that's just a bush. The problem is I think all the strips that we've got are flowers. Crenty, don't worry about it, you're here now, and that's all that really matters. Cadbury bush, we've got that, there we go, that's going to be used. Uh, is that different? There's a little bit of flowering in that, but that looks wild enough that it might be okay. Whoop. Same with golden rods. That might we might get away with that. Mm -hmm. Hi, Janty. What's this zoo called? Uh, temperate Zoo File uh, File Save Six. I think <laughs> we've never bothered naming it. Honestly. And then probably some nettles and stuff. They would they would just get up there, wouldn't they? Scabolias are all too small, too big, sorry. Uh, 
I kind of like these things. Yeah, I've already clicked those, look, but I do kind of like them. That's sort of thing we probably find up there. I have others who keeps that name. Yeah, me too. It's a bit too delicate, flary, I think. Right, I think there are options then. Uh, temperate Zoo Fowl Fowl 6 for my birthday. <laughs> temperate Zoo Fowl Fowl Save 6. He looks too extreme for me. All these, oh, they, 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 these could be. These could be. Oh, we have Cabri already, yeah. Mm. Okay, okay, I'm happy for that as well. Budlia, do we have Budlia? No. Nope. Is that just, just that's just a flower though, right? So you're saying that flowers flowers can work up there. Something down a bit so they're lower than the car. Yeah, that's the only thing with the golden rod. It's a bit, it's a bit big, right? I'm um, all oh yeah. I mean they're kind of crazy big, ain't? Eh? The problem is you're gonna sink it in. Yeah, no, maybe not golden rod then. I think color wise it probably would work, but uh, okay. So what we do need to do is duplicate this all over. I'll stick one over here just in case we mess it up. Not there often to uh, to maintain it. Yeah, no, exactly. It's definitely got to be stuff that's a bit wild there, but. Oh, is that ever come? Where the hell have I ended up there? Oh, <laughs> um, have I? Come out and off on those. No, not really. Fix that. Uh, there. Oh, jeez. Hey, old Michonne. Where's the, where's the bit I'm looking for? Have I not copied it? There's a little bit there. I mean, nobody's ever going to see it, but we're going to know, aren't we? We're going to know it's there. And that one's okay. That's already got it there, hasn't it? Okay, cool. How's it going? Pretty nice. I'm well, thank you. Hey, Johnsy. Sorry I've been uh, watching recently. I've been busy with work and uni. Currently having some food for us on my shift, though. So I drop by. How are you as well? Brad, we're doing great. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for letting me... Uh, thanks for keeping us in the loop. It's always nice to hear from regulars. But don't worry about not being able to make it. If it you know, life is life and we're here. And, we're, and the main thing is that I'm going to try, at least, to be here for you folks when, when, you, when, you, when you're free. Why the hell can't I zoom out? There we go. You come and join us when you can. You're always welcome. Hello, chump. Is that what he says? Hey, oh, yeah. Hello, chump. I just heard it then. Hey, oh, chump. <laughs> she said it as well. They're all joining in. Offensive little so-and-sos. So I'm not going to put it there. I think we'll keep it to the middle four. I think. There we go. Right, I'm just going to take a quick bio break. I'll be right back.
Chaos Gem. Keep it up. Keep it up. Hey, you mushroom. Abulas, keep it up. Armulas. Hey, oh, Armulas. Chum. Hey, oh, chump. <laughs> chump. Let's have a listen. Hey, oh, Hippenol, that one says. Look at that, that's a moustache and a half, that ain't it, look at him. Hippenol, yeah, yeah, chump. Uh, anyway, what are we doing? <laughs> oh, my phone is ringing. Who could this be? United States? Give me a second, folks. Has automated. This is the legal department of Service Canada. You are going to go to jail. Just like, can anyone ever fall for them? Really? People must do must now. They wouldn't bother doing it. Uh, I got a clock. I see. Uh, go get some. I'm going, Dylan. Yeah. As soon as I've, as soon as I've planted one of these up. So we can get an idea. It's more, it's more hedge-like, isn't it? Because of how freaking tall it is. I suppose it could, it could go that way and like lie over a bit, but. Hmm, it's a bit too neat. We might, we might have to go for like small plants that we build, build up ourselves rather than. Relying on those strips, I think. Yeah, that that looks better, I think, doing it that way. Uh, what did you do this time? That full of bays at the phone call then. I, it happens so often. I honestly get them so often. Yeah, that sound looks pretty good. Okay, cool. Right, we'll carry on with those uh, on m m m m m Monday, I guess. Yeah, it's it's Canadian Thanksgiving here on Monday, but we're, we're celebrating on Sunday because Nicola's working Monday. Um, oh no, probably won't Monday actually because I'll have because that the the daycare won't be open. Um, yeah, so we'll be back for live streams on Tuesday then. Because, uh, cause, yeah, I'll have Xander at home with me on Monday. But video should be out as usual. Um, so have a great weekend. If you are Canadian or you're in Canada, um, have a happy Thanksgiving. And uh, everyone else, be uh, be yeah, be safe and be well. That sounds good, Brad. Uh, have a good one. Uh, love you all to bits. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.